The battlefield is a scene of constant chaos. But if you believe in yourself and have dedication, pride, and never quit, you'll be a winner. To be a winner, you must plan to win, prepare to win, and expect to win. Good morning, everyone. Welcome to our Association of Science and Mathematics Educators of Philippine Private Schools National Battle of Math and Science Champions. This year's theme is Expanding Math and Science Horizon through ASMEPS initiatives. Today will be the battle of the best among the best all over the Philippines. I know that all of you are already winners, but today's contest will determine who will win among the best in the field of science and mathematics. To all the participants, I'm wishing you all the best. Go, go, go! To start this opening program, may I invite everyone to join us as we open this event with a prayer to be led by ASMEP's Board of Director, Sir Robert G. Dumali, to be immediately followed by our Philippine National Anthem. Good morning, everyone. Let's put ourselves in the Holy Presence of our God. In the book of Matthew, chapter 18, verse 20, it says here, For where two or three gather in my name, there am I with them. Let's pray. For God, we praise and we thank you for this morning. Thank you, Lord, for your goodness and faithfulness to each and every one of us. Thank you for your guidance throughout the years to the Association of Science and Mathematics Educators in Philippine Private School. Lord, we give up to you the battle of math and science champions for this year. We pray that may your will be done, O God, and me and you alone be glorified, Lord God, in this undertaking. Lord, be the one to give wisdom and guidance to all the participants and to all the representatives of different private schools, as well as, Lord God, for all the school administrators who supported this activity. Lord, once again, thank you. Uh, for everything, and this we pray, Lord, in Jesus' mighty name. Amen. Mga kababayan, ang pambansang awit ng Pilipinas. has been very successful for the past years because of your continual support to all the activities we have. Thank you for being our partner. We are very grateful to all of you. Now, to give us her opening remarks, may I call on the lady behind ASMEPS, the very responsible, hardworking, and ever approachable president. Let us all welcome Professor Eloisa E. Oliveira. Great and magnificent day, everyone. Welcome to the ninth year of the National Battle of Math and Science Champions, now on our third online edition, brought to you by the Association of Science and Mathematics Educators of Philippine Private Schools. This edition, we are extremely delighted that learners and coaches were able to continuously hold in-person trainings and coaching sessions as schools continually open 
and hold face-to-face -face classes after two years of home-based learning. It has been three years since we conducted our online competitions and next year, hopefully, we will now be back to the usual face-to-face -face battle of math and science champions. ASMEPS, being an active partner of the Department of Science and Technology, invited us for a big event because they are planning to conduct the first National Youth Science, Technology, and Innovation Fair or the NYSTIF on October 25 to 28 at PICC and they would like to collaborate with us of holding a competition among ASMEPS participating schools. Perhaps this will be the first face-to-face -face competition that we will see each other. Also, on August 5, 2023, we are strongly encouraging all champions to join the awarding ceremony to be held in Tagaytay, Cavite. Join us as we celebrate your winnings and accomplishments. I am also very glad to inform each and every one that your contribution to the, to the success of our activities went a long way. We were able to reach and offered service activities to our less privileged countrymen in various areas of the country. Because part of the registration fees forwarded to us MEPS were used for civic-oriented causes and we greatly appreciate your participation for the realization of the vision and mission of us MEPS. For letter S in the acronym ASMEPS also stands for service and sharing. Just recently, we were able to donate computer equipments and materials to house the Starbucks of DOST in Cabayan, Benguet. Starbucks is the first digital science library where a child or teachers can access information even without internet connection. And hopefully, this initiative of ASMEPS will expand the horizon of students and teachers in science and technology as what our theme for this year best explains. In the next coming months, we hope we can reach also some schools in other regions. So in behalf of ASMEPS family, our heartfelt thanks to your continuous support to all our advocacies. Good luck everyone and may God bless us all. Thank you, Ma'am Eloy, for that motivational remarks for everyone. To know more about us MEPS, let us all watch this audiovisual presentation prepared by our IT specialist, Sir Melvin V. Salvador.
that is what ASMEP's all about. Thank you, Sir Melvin. And now, to present the participating schools for today's event, may I call on the ASMEP's Board of Director, Ma'am Roselle B. Ginto. Good morning, fellow administrators, teachers, coaches, and students. Allow me to introduce to you the participating school for today's contest. First, we have the Academia de Barcelona Incorporated, Region 4A, Academia de Julia Victoria of Cavite Incorporated, Region 4A, Academy of Gentle Patters Children Incorporated, Region 4A, Academy of St. John LaSalle Green Hill Supervised, Region 4A, Ages and Stages School, Region 4A, Angelicum Primarosa Montessori School, Region 4A, Anini Central School, Region 7, Baguio Central School, CAR, Barrio Obrero Elementary School, NCR, BY Central Elementary School, Region 4A, Bloomsfield Academy, NCR, Blue Danube School Incorporated, Region 4A, Bristle Oak Academy, Region 4A, Brown International Schools, Region 4A, Cabanatuan City Senior High School, Region 3, Cabanatuan East Central School, Region 3, Kalikid Norte Elementary School, Region 3, Cavite School of Life, Dasmariñas, Region 4A, Cavite School of Life, Bacoor Campus, Region 4A, Center of Excellence in Public Education, NCR, Claret College of Isabela, Region 9, Coleo de Montessori, Region 4A, College from Immaculate Conception, Region 3, Compra National High School, Region 9, Crown of King Solomon Academy, Region 4A, De La Salle University Integrated School, Region 4A, De Paro Elementary School, NCR, Dilag Integrated School, CAR, Eastern College Incorporated Elementary, CAR, Eastern College Incorporated Senior High School, CAR, Epiphany Christian Academy of La Trinidad Incorporated, CAR, Fernando Maria Guerrero Elementary School, Region 3, Genex School of Leaders Foundation Incorporated, CAR, Grace Horizon Grade School, Region 4A, Happy Ziba Praisers Academy, Region 4A, Holy Redeemer School of Cabuyo Laguna Incorporated, Region 4A, Honorato C. Perez Senior Memorial Science High School, Region 3, Immaculada Conception College, NCR, Immaculate Conception Academy, East Campus, Immaculate Conception Academy, Plaza Campus, Immaculate Conception Academy, South Campus, Immaculate Conception Academy, West Campus, all from Region A, Imus National High School, Region 4A, International British Academy, Region 4A, Isabella de los Reyes Elementary School, NCR, J.P. Melencio Memorial Elementary School, Region 3, Cabasalan Science and Technology High School, Region 9, Katipunan National High School, Region 9, Lamisahan National High School, Region 9, Lazaro Francisco Integrated School, Region 3, Librada Avelino Elementary School, NCR. Liloy National High School, Lipa City Science Integrated National High School, Region 4A. Malawi National High School, Mandi Central School, Manikahan National High School, all from Region 9. Marciano del Rosario Memorial National High School, Region 3. Marian Learning Center and Science High School, Region 4A. Marie Osmond School, Region 4A, Mayapyap Elementary School, Region 3, Mayapyap National High School, Region 3, NEHS Senior High School, Region 3, Newville Heights Academy, Region 4A, Nueva Ecija High School, Region 3, Nueva Ecija University of Science and Technology, Nueva Ecija University of Science and Technology, Laboratory High School, all from Region 3, Occidental Mindore National High School, Region 4B, Our Lady of the Holy Rosary School, General Trias, and Opsi College of Cavite Incorporated from Region 
4A, Padre Mariano Gomez Elementary School, NCR, Pagadian City National Comprehensive High School, Region 9, Paluan National High School, Region 4B, Philippine Science High School, Eastern Visayans Campus, Region 8, Filsaga National High School Foundation Incorporated, Region 8, St. Bridget College, Batangas City, Region 4A, St. Francis of Assisi College, Das Marinas, St. Francis of Assisi College, Bacoor, and St. Michael Montessori de Carmona, all from Region 4A. Summer National School, Region 8, San Isidro Integrated School, Region 3, Scola de Vita, NCR, Sindangan National High School, Sindangan Pilot Demonstration School, Sindangan Sped Central, all from Region 9, Sisters of Mary of Banuks, Region 4A, Sister of Mary School, Adlas Incorporated, Region 4A, St. Beatrice Academy, Region 4A, St. Bridget College, Batangas, from Region 4A, St. Marta Montessori School, Barcelona, Region 4A, St. Peruvian Institute, Incorporated, from Region 4A, Santa Catalina College, Manila, NCR, Starlight Christian Learning Center, Region 3, Tabuk City National High School from CAR, Tampilisan Central School, Region 9, UCCP Anabu Christian School, Region 4A, Unida Christian Colleges, Region 4A, University of Baguio High School, CAR, University of Baguio Laboratory Elementary School, CAR, University of Perpetual Health Molino, Region, 4, Region 4A, University of the Cordilleras Junior High School, CAR, University of the Cordilleras Grade School, CAR, Young Shepherd Schools Incorporated from Region 4A, and last but not the least, Sambuanga del Sur National High School, Senior High School, Region 9. Thank you very much and God bless us all. Thank you, Ma'am Chelly. And thank you to all the participating schools, school administrators, coaches, parents, and participants. Good luck, everyone. And now to give us an inspirational talk, let us all welcome one of ASMEP's advisors, the Chief of Curriculum and Learning Management Division, Department of Education, Region 4A. Let us give a warm round of applause to Dr. Viernalin M. Nama. Greetings to everyone. Welcome to this year's National Battle of Math and Science Champions, online edition. So this is another opportunity for our learners to showcase their talents and also exercising brain-twisting abilities. And to our teacher coaches, they can share their best mentoring skills for their students. It is my great pride and honor that the Association of Science and Mathematics Educators of the Philippine Private Schools have gone too far in gathering and coordinating this kind of event and competition. ASMEPs expanded their horizon in science and mathematics through their initiatives on this online national battle of champions. So this is one way of promoting the ASMEPs brand of quality management. Based on data, many of the students who won the previous competitions of ASMEPs have outstanding academic records in their key stages of learning because they have benefited from the training and they have gone by venturing in this kind of contest. So another advantage of teachers and also the learners who engage in this activity, they build also their community. Because when a contest is run effectively, it is a great way to build a strong following. When ASMEPS started, there were only few schools collaborating within the area of Cavite. But now, they have expanded their horizon 
catering schools all over the country. So they have established a brand of honesty and also an equal opportunity to everyone. Building community is a strong point to build or to bring up, especially this time that we are utilizing social media platforms. So we must influence children doing positive activities online. Furthermore, this activity promotes awareness in the field of mathematics and sciences. Math and science education provides a framework for how to find answers to a lot of inquiries. And finally, joining here will promote teamwork. Collaborating with your teachers and also to trainers is very effective to develop your skills in the different categories of contests you will be joining because teamwork makes the dream work. Also, collaboration and communication skills is very relevant in the real life application. So as your team or your school strives to achieve a goal, you learn how to understand each other's specific skills and use it as a leverage to complete the task. So with that, I would like to congratulate everybody. All of you are winners already because you have reached this far, the national level competition. Let me end from the quotation of Andrew Whitworth. He said, if you are a true warrior, competition doesn't scare you. It makes you better. God bless everyone. Thank you, Dr. Virnalin M. Nama for that very inspiring message. To give us the general guidelines of today's event, let us all welcome Dr. Santos T. Castillo Jr. as MEPS Internal Vice President. This is the general guidelines of the National Battle of Math and Science Champions, Year 9. The ninth National Battle of Math and Science Champions is open to all winners of the ASMEPS Regional Math and Science Quiz, meaning top 1 to 20, including the qualifiers. Top 3, District and Division Math and Science Quiz winners of public and private schools. And the top 3 Private Schools Association Math and Science Quiz winners. To qualify, proof of winning should be submitted to asmaps at gmail.com. Number two, a strong and stable internet connection is required during the contest. It will be held on February 11, 2023, Saturday, using GasCloud LMS as the online quiz platform. Zoom platform will be used for attendance and actual test monitoring. Please school will use Xiaomi board in a Zoom platform. The first 10 students to get the highest score will be awarded with ASMEPS medallion. Gold, champion, silver, second place, and bronze, third to 10th place, with customized lanyard and e-certificate of merit. Next, 11 to 20 will be this, will receive a certificate of merit. All champions are invited to join in the Champions Night Awarding Ceremony to be held on August 5, 2023 in Tagaytay with a minimal fee. Medals of Calvita School should be claimed by the school's officials presently during office hours at Immaculate Conception Academy, City of Das Marinas, Laguna Schools at St. Clair of Assisi School, Gulod, Cabuyo City, Laguna. Medals of other regions will be sent to their respective division offices for proper endorsement and recognition. Asterisk Medallion with customized lanyard will be received by the first 10 students to get the highest scores. Thank you very much. For every contest, Mechanics and guidelines are very important. 
for the contest mechanics for the grade school, high school, and senior high school, let us all listen to ASMEP's internal vice president, Dr. Evangeline P. Detera. Good morning. To all participants, listen attentively and understand as I read the contest mechanics for grade school, junior high school, and senior high school level. Number one, participants will automatically be given a unique username and passwords after successful registration to log in to Gas Cloud Technology Solution, LMS, to take the entire respective examination. Number two, participants will use another gadget to log in to a provided Zoom Meet link with the camera on for monitoring purposes. A student should wear headset or headphone during the exam. Number three, checking of attendance is synchronized with the LMS. Thus, a student should be physically present all the time and the Zoom Meet link during the duration of the exam. Number four, participants for the grade school will be given 45 minutes to finish the entire exams. One hour for the high school level and participants will only have a single chance to select his or her answer in every questions, no changing of answer once selected. And next, the system is set up for first attempt final answer in all questions. The system will not allow participants to change and go back to the previous questions. And number five, only submitted answers to the LMS will be considered and counted. Number six, items shall be categorized as easy, average, and difficult questions. Each shall compose of 10 items for grade school and 15 items for high school. One correct answer under the easy level corresponds to one point. Average level for two points and difficult level for three points. A total of 60 points for the grade school level and 90 points for senior and junior high school levels. Number seven, strictly no using of calculator during the test. Blank sheet of paper may be used for computation during the math quiz. And number eight, Coverage of the test. The test questions will be based from the one-year DepEd minimum learning competences for each grade level. Additional information will be taken from current news and print or in media. For senior high school, science question will be based in their earth science and life science. For mathematics questions, will be based on basic mathematics and statistic probability. And for number nine, only the list of winners issued or posted by the ASMEPs are considered official results. To all of you participants, good luck and be a champion. God bless. Thank you, Ma'am Vanji. And now for the kindergarten contest, let us listen to the mechanics and guidelines to be presented by our ASMEP Secretary, Ma'am Sonia B. Brebonaria. For kindergarten level, the students will be given a Zoom Meet link to join the examination. Parents should provide three pieces of one half band paper with big letters A, B, and C written respectively. This will serve as the show me board of the contestants. Number assigned by us maps should be written boldly at the right side of the show me board. Students should wear headset during the examination. 
parents are not allowed to interfere during the contest and no individual should be seen within the vicinity. Students may wear their school uniform or any decent clothes. There will be 15 questions to be asked, 5 questions for the easy round to be answered in 5 seconds, 5 questions for the average round to be answered in 8 seconds, and 5 questions in the difficult round to be answered in 10 seconds. The question will be read by the quiz master twice and will give the signal for the students to raise their show me boards. No changing of answers once raised. The first answer raised will be considered by the board of judges. Answer of students are considered void in cases he or she fails to raise his or her board in the given time. First. 10 students who get the highest scores will be announced as winners and non-adherence to the above rules may be led to the disqualification of the contestant. And that ends our opening program for today. God bless all of us. Remember, success consists of going from failure to failure without loss of enthusiasm. The secret of your success is determined by your daily agenda. However difficult life may seem, there is always something you can do and succeed at. Your positive action combined with positive thinking results in success. To all of you, God bless everyone, especially to the participants. This has been your host, Ma'am Juliet P. Aranya, ASMEP's Assistant Secretary, saying, a blessed morning to all and good luck. Thank you very much.